Right now we're at the inaugural International Canine TCCC short course. Canine TCCC is battlefield care for military working dogs. It's a product of new guidelines that were published in January of 2020 that formalizes treatment for handlers and medics to provide care on the battlefield. This is the first time we're hosting a K9 TCCC course. For us, it's that big opportunity to learn that stuff we would not be able to because we are, I'm not a dog handler and my medic is no dog handler too. So there's, we, we do not have that opportunity in the normal army. This is a three-day course and it builds on itself with day one being a tactical patient assessment. Day two, all the participants had ample time to learn all the different treatments involved with K9T C. And on day three, they will be running through scenarios and getting tested on their ability to put it all together. The in-depth medical stuff that I learned is, it's so good to know when you're a dog handler because um, if something happens, you need to be able to deal with the situation, even under pressure, which we got to do. So the Marsh algorithm is what we've been training here. It's the basis of K9T C, and it's not much different from the human version. It's the, except for the first M in March stands for muzzle. That way everyone stays safe while they're treating a military working dog. The second M is for massive bleeding. The A is for airway. The R is for respiration. The C is for circulation. And the H is for hypothermia. This algorithm allows the participants to treat from the most critical life-threatening injury in a logical fashion. Overall, the training was amazing. I learned so much. Um, I loved that we had a class and then a hands-on, and then we ran through a bunch of scenarios, different types of scenarios. I want to thank uh, for the invitation and all the instructors were pretty pretty well, pretty awesome. I'll take uh, with me a lot of knowledge and I will try to get that to my fellow colleagues.